Okay, y'all. So, yeah, I'm in the bathroom recording because I'm in a place where there's not really a lot of light. <laughs> As usual, you know, the bathroom has the best light. But anyway, um, I just wanted to say, hey, I haven't really recorded much this week. Um, one, because I haven't really done anything other than go to school. And two, i just been feeling a little down and depressed, and I know you guys really don't care to see that because it's sad. Um, but yeah, I went to church today for a Bible study, and y'all are going to go downstairs with me because I'm hungry, and I'll tell y'all what we talked about. Okay, so a lot of you want to know where I stay because I get that question like just randomly, like where do you stay now? I'm at my uncle's house, so this is not the regular kitchen you see at my parents' house. But before we get started on what we talked about in church today, has anyone ever had this? I decided to try it. It looked kind of good um, when I was in Target and I was looking for junk food. <laughs> and I just happened to get a smart one. I think this is for like, it is. For Weight Watchers, for people trying to lose weight. I am not trying to lose weight. Let's make that clear. I'm just randomly losing weight. And I think it's stress and stuff. But my average weight is usually like 136, 134, 136. Last time I checked, I was 122. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Anywho, I'm going to get it started, and then we're going to talk about what I learned at church today, because y'all need to hear the word, just like I need to hear the word, so. While I'm waiting on that to warm up, look at this sand my uncle got. Look, I don't know if you can really see it, but look at this. It's like, like it does, it's that sand that doesn't dry out, and it's just like, I don't know. I, I feel kind of weird about it because I'm from like near the beach area, like 20 minute drive to the beach. So like, I feel sand. I know what sand feels like. That's not sand, but I just want to play in it. It's like Play-Doh for adults. And I'm like, mm. but okay, so two minutes, boom. He talked about four O's of, like, this is your time, this is your season. Uh, first is optical. He said he was stretching with that one. And it's being aware of your surroundings. No, um, when you see it, like, that's for you. Um, don't miss the train because you scared to get on it type thing. Second one was optimism. Be happy, optimistic about your situation, even if it's not the best that you want to be in at the moment. The third was some Greek word that started with an L, but it mean um, community. Um, check who you're around. Ah, check who you're around, positive people. Um, even if, like, you know sometimes you have friends that are in a place where you want to be. Like, maybe they're in a relationship or they have a job. And it seems like all your friends are like that. Find someone who is in a situation that you're in, like if all your friends are in a relationship, find a single friend and you guys can hang out and maybe meet other single people, like, you know, so it's not saying you have to break it off with those friends, but you know, wait for your time with someone else that's also waiting for their time to come. And then the fourth one is oldness. I'm trying to do this in other two under two minutes. The fourth one was oldness. Um if you ask advice of an old person, let them be old let them tell you, and when they tell you something crazy, just don't be like, oh, mm -mm, that's that's old school, I don't want to do that. Like, let them help you. They know. They've been here, they've done it before. Let them help you. Take their advice. Keep it moving. 15 seconds. Don't use the excuse of not knowing how to do something, because there's always going to be an older person who has done it. He said, don't be the oldest person you hang out with. Boom. Four O's is your time. Take that and run with it and apply it to your life as I have done so with mine. Boy, look at this. Wait, you can't even see. Look at that. What is this? What? What is that? I'm confused. This is why people lose weight. I understand now why. You guys are losing weight on Weight Watchers. There's, it ain't no food in there. Look at there is 
this little piece of chicken and that little piece of chicken. That's the same piece from before. Like, or maybe I just load my chicken alfredo up with chicken. Maybe that's what, maybe you're not supposed to put that much chicken in there. Nah, nah, that's just not enough. Mm, but I'm gonna eat it though because it smells good. All right, Kayla, tell them what you be thinking about whenever they be speaking Spanish. <laughs> They be sound like <laughs> And then they start laughing yeah. And we just be like Well I want to laugh <laughs> What did I do that I don't deserve to laugh <laughs> Yo this track is real People always be asking me like How you a Spanish major you don't know Spanish Are you fluent? Say something in Spanish I be like hola Hey <laughs> Adios <laughs> the struggle is real, but we're gonna get there one day, y'all. We'll get through it. Just don't ask me to translate nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I should think she could sing. Oh my god. Uh -oh. <laughs> put it on Facebook. <laughs> and it's my I'm gonna get my before. Okay. Uh, send it to me. Okay. She can't seem like me though. And it made it this far for better or worse. What? We got some right over. You ready? Mm. You ready? You starting to me. Okay. All right, y'all. Tell me who's singing better. You ready? I'm sorry because I know okay. that part. Ready? Hello. Hello. It's me. I don't know, know the rest. Other words. I was I forgot. We got. We just gotta go to the chorus because I forgot. <laughs> to go over everything. They say I'm supposed to heal ya. I ain't done much either. Neither <laughs> one of the words. <laughs> just get that part. Skip that part. I must have called a thousand times to tell you I'm sorry. Everything that I've done, when I called you, never seemed to be home anymore. You wanna say hey? Oh, what? You wanna say hey? Okay. <laughs> She's so dry. <laughs> She's still singing. Oh, Jesus. Because once I start, I really can't. Stop, stop, right. Stop, stop. in the name, name of love. love. Before you break my heart to get over. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hello. Guess who's back, back, back. Well, I'm back in Raleigh. I didn't spend time with you guys this weekend because... Um, my great grandma passed away this morning, so this weekend I took a trip home to say my goodbyes and spent time with my family. So that's one reason why this vlog is gonna be short. Obviously, I don't think you guys want to see a lady just laying in bed dying. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, and I finally changed hoodies because it was hot today. I wore the black hoodie. Because I had just found it and I got real excited and I just wore it <laughs> like forever in a day and didn't take it off. I turned a lot on, I promise they like warm up. But um but yeah, this is gonna be the end of the vlog. Look, I'll go in here so you can see me. This is gonna be the end of the vlog. Um hold on one second. Oh, I don't know. I'll see you guys next Monday. Um, I will, yeah. I don't really know what to say other than my great-grandma died. So, RP. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. Oh, yeah. That's what I was going to say. Happy Black History Month. 
got to wear the hair natural for Black History Month, you know. That and because I was tired of my struggle bun. But, you know. Happy Black History Month.